All right, on the line, we have everybody's favorite time-traveling trash talker. This is 40s Man. How are you today, 40s? Say, you dime store Santas. How are you? I'm just swell. Of course, I see that you've dragged my sorry cackus back on the wireless once again in order to give you the what for in the talking pictures. I should be down at the cell ringing the bell for Zuzu pedals, don't you know? <laughs> <laughs> I don't get a blood nickel for this racket. <laughs> this holiday season, rather than remaking a wonderful life with invalids, transvestites, and people of color, the Hollywood Brain Trust has decided to let the cats out of the bag. Now, in my day, the cowardly lion would just slip into his costume, get smeared with orange makeup, and wait for his close up. But not here in these trying times. Nope, the modern day Cecil B. DeMille are using a gimmick they call CGI. Now, the only time I ever encountered that term was while I was stationed in Guadalcanal in 42. There I was, in the supply tent that doubled as a bordello. And I asked one of the senior leaders if she'd like me to drop my trousers. She just whispered in my ear, B-G-I. <laughs> so, long story short, is that CGI makes you see things that aren't there. Where, where, where I come from, seeing things that aren't there got you tossed in the rubber room quicker than the oldest Kennedy sister after one too many Helen Keller impressions. <laughs> the only cats I want to see on the silver screen are named Sylvester, Tom, and Felix. <laughs> These here cats are about as welcome as an SPCA in Chinatown. <laughs> oh, no. Word to the wise from my pal Hopstein. Stay away from the Miao Shu Pork. <laughs> Another flick that's getting attention for all the wrong reasons is The Irishman, starring Bobby De Niro and three other corpses. <laughs> Why, they layered so much of that CGI malarkey on Al Pacino's mug that Jimmy Hoffa himself came out of hiding just to give Marty Scorsese a Dutch oven. <laughs> Joe Pesci was so unrecognizable at times that Yoda tried to sue for defamation of character. <laughs> Whatever happened to the good old days when Ebenezer Scrooge would put the screws to Bob Cratchit, get the Jesus scared out of him by ghosts, and then winds up sharing a turkey leg with the crippled kid. Now there was the picture. <laughs> I'm 40s man, boys. And I got a scram. Thank you so much, 40s man. <laughs>